What you do, prepare yourself a tray with a little bit of uh, parchment sheet underneath. Mm. Pa 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 <laughs> and then you start to, let's not start with this. <laughs> so then you start to uh, roll your pastry out. Stay with me, okay? And this is going to be, it's going to be shit old way. <laughs> so, you know, is there any other word for this so then I can use? Just a sheet. It just a sheet. sheet. Just, just saying so it correctly will do it. What you have to do, um, you roll out the sheet <laughs> until more or less the same <laughs> size, size, size of really. this other sheet. <laughs> so, you know... <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. You won't Sorry. have time to make it. Okay. You don't really that doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. <laughs> then you pop it on like this. You can make it longer or straight as much as you want. We get, we get with that. With your hands. I'm not really a green juice man. I'm more, I'm more a black juice man. I, I still have my cans of Guinness in the fridge. Good man. And and the, the problem is though that you can't really go out and have a drink in LA. You know, because if you have a drink in LA, if you have more than three drinks... Oh, they think you're regional. Okay? Oh, I know. Oh, they do. Whereas if you're Scottish or Irish, I mean, that's... that's just, you're just getting started. You're just starting the night. <laughs> exactly. They go, Patrick, we really need to talk about <laughs> your, your drinking. I'm <laughs> going, you're right, that's empty. <laughs> Fill it up. <laughs> it's true. I, mean, I once went to a party out there and everything stops at midnight. They literally pulled the plug. Yeah. I've never seen that in my life. I mean, it's And like... we were roaming the streets trying to find booze. Lylan has all the latest showbiz gossip at midday. And at 12.15. We'll be tasting Fern Cotton's cupcakes. Before all of that, uh, from top tips for making your summer makeup last throughout the day to a skincare exclusive from a familiar TV favourite. <laughs> Here's Good <laughs> Housekeeping <Coffee's> Magazine. <laughs> Good Housekeeping Magazine's beauty director, <laughs> Eve Cameron. If you have to do it on telly, you're doing it on telly. So you know where you bounce. <laughs> here's, the, uh, here's the beauty desk. Oh my God, you're not helping. He's like, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. <laughs> Run, VT, for God's sake. I like the cheeky little flap look. The little yeah, that's, sort what, of... that's what they did in Banana yeah, Lounge. Yeah, they like, like, oh, 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 so my flap's yeah. come down. Oh, it's <laughs> Particularly. Oh, disgusting. All your family are watching this. You're ashamed of yourself. Oh. Your daughter, in front of your daughter. <laughs> Terrible. Well, Bess, are you alright? Yeah, I'm fine. <sighs> Sorry. Bit of sandy clam stuck in your throat. And there's our, <laughs> there's our best bit for a Thursday. Oh, God. <laughs> Before. We are just about to do the weather. In fact, it's your big dream, isn't it, Big Nasty? Big to do the them. weather live on TV. So this is your moment. Take it away. So I'm going to change the graphics for you. Just a little hint. It's cold and wintry, so take it away. All right, boom. The streets of England. <laughs> Hear what I'm trying to say to you, yeah? No one T-shirt business. It's cold and the down there. See all down there? Blitz Creek. Double up, double up, double up, double up. See you over there? Extra clothes. Wellies, <laughs> mud fest. Anyone who's got pets, no say you're gonna be getting bare mud in your yard. Edinburgh, peak times. Highlands, 
a bag of snow. <laughs> London, <laughs> we're dealing with a seven down here. So it's moderately cool, but please dress appropriately for the weather. And ladies and kids, dress warm. <laughs> the flu is killing us. The flu is out here to get us. Yeah? So let me sip and warm clothes. Uh, hold on, hold on. You, you can stop now because you were just a little bit too good. Yeah, you were. I'm not coming for your job. I'm not coming for your job. Okay, okay, okay. Otherwise, I might have to start spitting two, two bars. Tell them, tell them. Because anyway, it's cold outside. Right. Man better know that it's cold outside. <laughs> Man's not hot. Man's not hot. Go <laughs> <laughs> Quite creamy. It's, it it should have a nice creamy texture. Um, slightly. But the sauce, Gino, is absolutely beautiful. Is it nice and uh, So shut your eyes. I know what you're going to do. Not a big one. I'm not eating a big one. I let, oh. oh, that's a big one. I can't. I can't. It's daytime. <laughs> it breaks my rule. Well, come oh, on, you God. shut your eyes and do it. <laughs> this is lovely. Oh, don't oh, look at it. Don't, go. Look, at it. don't look at it. Don't look at it. Go. See, it's all right when she when you. Once in, I love it. But nice, you see? <laughs> <laughs> hey, welcome back uh, uh, to this morning. <laughs> oh dear, dear, dear. <laughs> so, I love to come to the show. I love to do the show. <laughs> oh, I've missed you. <laughs> Now, the world's most decorated Olympian, the swinger, swimmer, Michael Phelps, will race against a great white shark. Sorry, everyone, <laughs> that was not, not at all <laughs> supposed to happen. I, I can see a already on Michael Phelps. <laughs> <laughs> I know nothing. That's not, I'm not announcing anything. There's no breaking news. I absolutely meant to say swimmer, by the way. I can see their shocked faces. <laughs> Just move on, don't make a big deal. I think you might just swim very fast out of this one. I don't think, <laughs> I, I don't think anyone noticed, honestly. He's going to be swimming against a great white shark for the Discovery Channel Shark Week. With, with my soups, we ch I chop it all yep. up, we stick it in a pan, add some water, and then when, when it's all cooked, we just you stick do that. It, yeah, but do I get the same? Go on. It does it spray all around you? No, no. Oh, not the, the stick then, don't know. No, with the stick, with the mirror. Yeah, Liquidizer does. It's all right. Yeah. But no, I've never whizzed it over the kitchen. No. <laughs> should have not. <laughs> <laughs> and on that note, thank you very much. Thank you, pleasure. Thank you. My pleasure. <laughs> Steph really doesn't approve of <laughs> We know we've got some really amazing ones coming mm. up. And then outside that, I've been kind of looking at how I could extend that in a much bigger way. Oh, that... look at that. Could you Somebody get, like, could you get one torch. of your builders then? Is that? I don't know what happened It's Billy in the house. Is Billy our electrician? <laughs> is that as he. <laughs> I don't know. That was, that was really strange. That was, wasn't it? <laughs> Julie on. The, That's the effect of you. The, <laughs> I, know I, know, I think there was Piers <laughs> leaving the building. He has that effect on the, like, the shift oh, in the... It's usually lightning. <laughs> <laughs> People crying in corners. <laughs> okay. uh, number seven. The kids are staying at Grandma's tonight. <laughs> oh, no, that's too much expectation. That was scary. OK, and number 11. Number 11. I want you so bad right now. <laughs> I reckon you'd be a number 11. You, 11 would get you going. <laughs> He'd never say that to me. He just goes, close the curtains. <laughs> So, everyone's got a story like that. Us, Give us, it wasn't us. It Give was us a call. 08000 30 40 44. Calls are free from all consumer landlines and mobile phones. You can also email us this morning at itv.com. We'll need your emails by <laughs> today. And you must be 18 or <laughs> Oh, no. This is the worst it's happened for ages. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, we haven't done this for a long time. You can't stop. You can't stop. You can't. <laughs> You've started it. You can't stop. Oh, I'm gonna cry my eyelashes off. <laughs> okay. Right, it's your link. Right. Okay. Now, before all of that, from soothing tired feet to calming a stressed mind, you might just find a secret weapon at the bottom of your car. I'm actually crying. <laughs> at the bottom of your garden. Yes, it seems that Peppermint is one of nature's unsung heroes. Luckily, Liz Earl, she's a sensible lady, is on hand to tell us how to harness its incredible natural power. I think we got away with that. 